Hello friends, in this video, I will show you how to edit photos. New York, on the street, decolorized. You can really edit anywhere with this color style. Not necessarily in New York. So first, I will open this photo. File raw. Then I will see the histogram. So this photo is a bit underexposed, you see. If the highlight is missing, I will add 0.3 stops. To brighten the photo. Continuing, I still find it lacking, I can add more contrast. Continue adding 0.3 stops more. Because my intention was to decolorize this photo. So I just increase the brightness, then a little bit I will reduce it later. You can see the skin is a bit dark. Then I can go to skin, white skin, I increase subject skin. Increase in the dark areas to make it even slightly. Groom, this upper part is bright. The lower part is dark. So I'm going to increase the bottom a little bit. Then I can go to skin for this part. I choose beauty skin. Let me adjust the skin for the bride and groom. Then this skin part you can do it easy. So I will not guide this part in detail, so you do it yourself. Okay, I pass this skin part. In this photo, I usually correct this color. After I will adjust the color more brightly, I will see that it is white balance, I look at the white dress. It's a bit yellowish. Then I will reduce the yellow color, by subtracting yellow or white balance. Then I will subtract the white balance first. The second one, if I find it to be yellow, I will subtract yellow. Because this photo I also wants to decolorize, so I minus yellow too. Then you see before, after, it doesn't change anything. Then I subtract white balance again. Then I feel a bit green. Palish. But still okay. Now the dress is white. So now if I find the cause a bit pale, I can add this vibrance to it. Then you see when adding the vibrance. Do you see? Pale skin right. Then I add vibrance. Then my skin is rosy. And if you want more, you add a little more. Because of this photo, what do I plan to do? I plan to decolorize, so feel free to increase the color. No problem. I will merge all these layers together. Before, after. Then I don't care about the colors around. Because I intend to decolorize it. Then the second one is that I will motion blur these people. Then I will go to brush, motion blur. Then after I blur these people, I will see that my photo has depth. Because it's more subject focused. I zoom back in. Note that to scan carefully, do not let it touch the hair of the subject. Then I scan carefully, don't touch the subject. For the parts that are close to the subject, I have to do it carefully. And when the things are far from the subject, you can scan comfortably. Then you see with this motion blur. Here, I have focused on the subject. I should zoom out so that I can see what part of it is left, then I scan it carefully. Next, I will decolorize. How do I decolorize? S then I click here. Then when you choose this brush, you scan, you will see that the color it lost. Do you see? It's similar to the bounce when I scan the motion. The more you have to zoom in on the subject and scan. Do not let it get on the subject's skin or body. I have to deal with the part that is close to the subject very carefully. Then with the thing that was before. To set motion blur or something else is very time consuming. And the parameters are very complicated. Then with this fine art secret. Then you just need to click and I will have a suitable compatible tool for me to handle. Then you see that you want to delete the color, then click on delete color. If you want to increase the light, click on increase the light. To increase contrast, Click on contrast. 
Very convenient. I can zoom closer to delete. You guys do it well. Then this part is a guide, so I just demo for you to see. Because it will make tutorial longer and boring if we do it. These are the things that you need to be very detailed. Very carefully, so that I can get the right picture quality. Then here I demo for you. Then after I scan carefully, I will have a photo like this, you see. Before, after. Do you see? It changes a lot. And to make this picture sharper, you can choose to add detail to the photo. There you see, the picture is clearer, more embossed. And I can also scan more contrast or detail. Into the details of the building. Make it stand out more. There, these parts. I can scan it to make it more prominent. Because it's all black and white now. There is no part of it that competes with its subject. So you can handle it comfortably. You see with just a few simple steps. Here, the color photo. Then the subject is not focused. And I decolorize. Then you see that the subject stands out very impressively. My subject stands out very impressively. And here, I only have three layers. Brighten up. Vibrant colors. After that, I was blind. And then I whiten the lights. And here you can also block the image to make it darker. These parts are bright, I can choose burn. To recolor it, focus more on your subject. Note that this color scan is just a demo, you have to zoom in carefully to scan. Here is the tutorial, so I saves you time. But I need to zoom in and I delete these borders. So I finished editing a photo, you see. Very impressive. Here, light up. Blur people. And finally remove the color.